Welcome back and back to that breaking news we told you about at the top of the hour. Nampa police say they shot and killed a man this afternoon. It happened around 1:30 near Marketplace Boulevard and Midland Boulevard. Police told our Hector Mendoza the series of events leading up to that shooting started at the St. Luke's Hospital in Nampa, but ended at the McDonald's nearby on Marketplace Boulevard. And Hector joins us live now from that scene. Hector, what can you tell us? Well, like you mentioned, uh, things kind of started off and made their way here to the McDonald's where I'm located. We see a lot of police presence. There's police tapes. Roads are blocked off. The road that I'm standing on right now is currently blocked off. Uh, one of the things that we did that was that was told by us was that no one was hurt in this incident. But what we do know is that things started off at the St. Luke's Hospital down the road. Uh, the suspect was a patient at the hospital where he escaped. St. Luke's called police to report the incident at about one this afternoon. The Nampa police received more calls from people that the man was in the middle of the street and making his way down Midland towards Marketplace Boulevard. Officers said that they also got reports from restaurants on Midland that the suspect had entered multiple places, including Old Crab Cajun Seafood and Bar, where police say the man grabbed a knife. Officers did mention a location, didn't mention a location, that is, but the suspect also tried to hijack a car but wasn't able to. Then the man made his way towards McDonald's, where officers finally caught up with him. Then officers say the man charged at them with the knife, and an officer shot and killed the man. No one else was hurt in this incident. And interim police chief Kurt Schenkel says when a person charges an officer with a weapon, they don't have much of a choice. We only take the action we're forced into. We never want to shoot anybody. We never want to use force on somebody. But when force is being used on us, or somebody's coming at us with a deadly weapon, whatever that scenario is, the officer doesn't have much of a much of a choice, right? The officer is there to serve and save the public and to save themselves. The officer was put on administrative leave. Uh, the the agency that is leading the investigation is Kenya County Sheriff's, and we will update you with more information as that becomes available. Sure. All right, Hector Mendoza reporting live in Nampa. And again, as he mentioned, we are staying on top of this, and we'll keep you updated right here on KTVB as well as KTVB.com.